Hello friends and welcome back to Adda Desi. In today's episode of University Life, we are going to shift our focus to the old line state in the East Coast. We are going to talk about University of Maryland located in College Park. First, let's look at the application requirements. There are total seven application requirements for University of Maryland. First, an honor application that costs around seventy-five dollars. Second, transcripts. Third, a statement of purpose. Fourth, three letter of recommendation. Fifth, a resume. Sixth, a GRE. And seventh, an English proficiency test that is your IELTS, TOEFL, or PT score. The minimum score requirement for the English proficiency test is as follows: PT sixty-eight, TOEFL ninety-six, and IELTS seven. One good news is that GRE is optional for most of the courses because many test centers were closed during COVID. The average profile score of computer science admit is as follows: GRE three hundred seventeen, and for TOEFL one zero four. Next, let's talk about the graduation requirements and the tuition fee structure. Before we move forward, I have a small request. If you like the work that we do, then please don't forget to like our video and subscribe to our channel. This will help us and give us the confidence to keep on making such informative videos in the future. Now back to our video. I'll take a computer science course as an example to talk about the graduation requirements and the tuition fee structure. If you need the specifics about your program, you can comment below, and I'll definitely reply to that. One needs to complete a minimum of 30 course credit to complete the graduation, and this can take at least 24 months or four semesters. A minimum of two GPA is required for graduation in all courses. A higher GPA may be required depending on each department. The cost of one course credit is 8,288 for an in-state student. But for an out-of-state or interstate student, the cost of one course credit is one thousand eight hundred five. So the total tuition fees cost for thirty course credit for an in-state student lands around twenty-four thousand eight hundred forty, and for an interstate student or out-of-state student, it lands around fifty-four thousand one hundred fifty. One thing to note here is that this is just an estimate, and the tuition fee structure keeps on changing each semester. Next, let's check out the housing cost. There are both on-campus and off-campus housing options available in University of Maryland. The cost of one bed, one bath room on campus is around fifteen hundred to sixteen hundred dollars. Off-campus housing offers more affordable options, so many graduate students prefer off-campus housing. You can visit our website adadisi.com and find many such off-campus housing options. The average rent of a two-bed, two-bath apartment is around eighteen hundred dollars to twenty-five hundred dollars per month, and the average rent of a person is around thousand dollars to thirteen dollars, thirteen hundred dollars per month. Average monthly utility bill is around eighty to one thirty dollars per person. Next, let's talk about transportation. University of Maryland comes in Washington D.C. metro area. So it is well connected by the metro bus and metro rail. Ride starts at one dollar sixty-five cents for metro rail and increases during rush hours. Metro bus costs around one dollar fifty cents with a smart trip card. University of Maryland offers free shuttle service for all the students with a valid ID. The closest international airport to University of Maryland is the BWI, that is Baltimore Washington International Airport. Next, let's talk about the on-campus jobs. University of Maryland have many departments such as dining services, rec well, resident life, and university libraries that hire large number of students. UMD provides a job portal to students where one can apply directly using their resume. Students who are enrolled for a full time are allowed to work on campus. With a 20 hour per week limit, the average pay is around $13 to $17 per hour. University of Maryland has a large campus. It is right outside DC, which means there are a lot of opportunities for research, internship, and jobs after graduation. But a small chunk of those jobs require clearance, green card, or a citizenship. University of Maryland is relatively expensive too compared to other universities. 
As always, I would like to wish you all the best for all your future endeavors and please follow us on Facebook and Instagram to using the link below. Thank you.